So yeah, with the uh, water bottle thing, as soon as I got back, right, there's uh, a dude, some little fuck nigga. Again, he walked, it's, it's, it's fucking five o'clock on a fucking uh, Thursday. He didn't have workout clothes. He walked, he comes out, he has a water bottle in his hand. Like I said, again, the tall one, like that fuck nigga in the black car. Like I said, I'm pointing it out just in case we get to the point where we can prosecute these stupid ass niggas. And they deserve it, like I said, because really, it, they deserve way more than prosecution. You know, these these fucking uh, bitch ass niggas, you know, you want, if you gonna, if you a criminal, you street nigga, you a thug, whatever, you do that shit, you let niggas know you did it. You don't do no whole shit, hiding behind your mama's skirt, all this bullshit, nigga. So that's why I say you deserve to be in fucking prison, because you a sucker bitch ass nigga. You fake and you phony. You won't say what you, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you hiding and shit, you hiding what you do, not from, not from the police, you working with the fucking police. So anyway, he gets out. As soon as I pull up, just usual, he comes out here. I, I ain't. He got a California tag on his car. Normally, you see out of state tags, you think something else. But like I said, he's a gang stalker. Like uh, like they, they, you know, one got the mask on. You notice? Let me see when he turned around. Do the man had a mask on? Watch my other video from earlier today. Remember the dude in the white car? He didn't have a mask on, but his wife had a mask on. Them, them two idiots right there. Let's see. He doesn't have the, you know, they're doing this thing with the buying groceries. Uh, you, you see what I'm saying? You know, because I went, I just went shopping today. I bought one thing. <laughs> you know, one thing that, that's uh, edible. You know what I'm saying? I bought one fucking thing. I told you these niggas turning this shit into some kind of, they're, they're socialists. They want free shit. They want free money. All right, so listen to what, I got into it again. I ain't getting into it. Just now, just watch the matter of fact, I need to play these video because I, I I thought about it. It'll take longer to post each one because first of all, is they real short. I should just play them all and let y'all see them. They trying to act like they don't want free shit, so they had a couple of the ones who worked. Like I said, uh, the nigga I talked to. Uh, he thought he 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 was a, a you know a special nigga. And he don't understand. He not special. Yeah, I've been trying to warn him, nigga. You you trying to all that you you know you worked all these years at the same job, nigga. You throwing all that. That's all right. I can't help you. If, if shit come down to it, and it's not because about me or you. It's because what you did. I want history to know what the fuck you did. You sold other black folks out to get your little position. I don't care what kind of history you got. I can't stick up for you for that. It ain't it ain't gonna be. Oh, he so I, I I you turned that man into the white no nigga you because matter of fact he 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 was one of them ones he said it out of his mouth. White folks been doing it for years, but you know what? With the white folks, if they are corrupt, they still make sure they cities look good. So if you got white Republican motherfuckers who are corrupt, they cities they cities still look good. Y'all motherfuckers did, did y'all so fucking stupid. Y'all stole all the goddamn money and didn't fix the fucking cities. If you doing it like white folks did, white folks do it too. Why the fuck they cities look better than ours? If you did, it's because they don't say they didn't do it. They just say, oh, but white folks do it too. So why the fuck our cities fucked up and their cities don't look fucked up? Where all the money went? You stupid bitch. If you're going to fucking steal the money, at least goddamn just steal part of it. And fix the fucking city. But you ain't, you know, y'all so stupid. Y'all thought, oh, we'll do, we'll throw a fucking barbecue every fucking year and give book bags to the kids. And that looks like we care about the black community. And we can steal all the money we want. Because these stupid motherfuckers ain't going to say nothing. As long as we keep uh, yelling and acting like we uh, white folks did it. It's white folks. All we got to do is keep saying white folks. And they won't even look our way. They won't even look for where the money is. These don't, we got, we got these stupid ass niggas, you know what I'm saying? Are your own folks calling y'all stupid and showing you. They ain't just calling you stupid, they showing you you fucking stupid. And y'all still running around, just like that stupid ass nigga that came out 20 minutes ago when I pulled up. Usually they pull up and shit, you know, especially today, he might pull back up if he stay over here. Some little bitch ass nigga, he might pull back up. He was parked in some little kind of blue Toyota. 
Let's see if this bitch ass nigga pull back up. But uh You know, so anyway, let me just play these. Well, no, nah, let me say what I got to say before I, uh, I forget. So after the last video I'm going to play, I got one. You know, I was talking shit, you know, real truth and shit about these these fake ass. Like they got this little boy brainwashed walking around and shit. He don't even understand. He's so young. He don't even know. He in front of the world of hurt because they, your, your people, and I don't mean your personal people like them, you know, I'm talking about these millions of pup motherfuckers that's in this group. They got you fucked up for life, homeboy. This shit is not going to work. You fucked up. You only 18. You going to have to learn the fucking hard way this, that, that it ain't finna be the ones who, who did get away with this shit for the last couple of years. It, it ain't really, they ain't even get away with it for that long. That's how stupid they are. They didn't even get away with it for that long. It didn't even last that long. So the ones you saw who you thought was doing it, as, as well, at least when our generation like to say, you thought they was doing it, they got you fucked up for life. You got a hard fucking life if you don't try to change and understand. I ain't even talking about try to change how you treat people, blah, blah, blah. No, just you going to have to get in. And I don't mean get in line like a literal line like, like them fuck niggas told you that we jumped in the line. I, no, I mean get in and get with the fucking program. They got you fucked up for real. They got you fucked up for life. If you don't fucking get with the fucking program. Ain't nobody said you gotta be a slave. Is it work hard for nothing. For zero dollars. You know work hard for a little itty bitty check. That's what the fuck we trying to tell you dumbass nigga. These motherfucking niggas got you fucked up like that. You know. The motherfuckers that flash it all in your face, try to look faster and all that shit. Who did it? You know what I'm saying? You, you want to know how I could tell because they get mad when you try to do something for yourself. They try to, 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 to slow you down and make it worse. Sometimes they do it under the guise that they care about you. Just negative shit. So, anyway, the bitch in the store, they came in. The video I'm gonna show you, I was at another one of them dollar store. I was trying to buy some supplies, you know, not for this for this shit, just shit that I need. But uh So as usual, it's a store I don't know, you know, I don't go to that much. But anyway, I'm walking around look for what I needed. And as usual, I hear two two niggas come in talking loud. They're old and they're in their fifties. Like I said, the ones that's really scared. That's why they came out. The motherfuckers, the, you know, the so-called professionals. That's why they came out. The niggas that's really finna get exposed. The ones that's really finna get it. You see what I'm saying? The 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 ones that really they coming out like fucking roaches and rats. And uh, you know, I said the other day, I don't, don't call them rats. I don't mean like rats, like uh other like we're all criminals in it together. No. I mean rats, just real live fucking rats, not the the Al Capone type of shit rats or or a modern day drug dealer rat. No, I mean rats against your own fucking people, like rats on a fucking ship, like a rat that like that rat that just came out to sit down or fucking cross the street, fucking rats. So anyway. I hear the conversation as usual. They talk real loud so you can hear them. See, that's the whole shit I'm talking about. Now, these two motherfucking, they're suckers. I can understand they're going to do that shit. But when y'all have niggas, y'all supposed to be, y'all present yourself as, as real street niggas, gangsters, all this shit. You can't be doing this shit. Like, this nigga, he came in. You could tell he fruity. Fruity as a motherfucker. He hanging with this bitch. Probably ain't even fucking the hoe. He, he hanging, you know, hanging with, he hanging, he actually literally a friend with the bitch. Oh, I bet she consider that nigga a real best friend. So he a fruity ass nigga. You could tell because the way he laugh, he come in like geek 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 and shit. And so they start talking about uh, they 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 literally say Trump. They they Trump and the and this stimulus shit. And uh, as usual, they try to act like they're you know just like they're really trying to say something smart and keep us from doing the wrong thing. Don't trust this money because this is this what's going to happen. They're going to take it out of your tax. If you you know just trying to just just evil deceitful nasty ass fuck nigga rat ass nigga shit. Why are y'all still trying to start this? Oh, I know why. Why do I keep asking why? Cuz they're about to be exposed for all the fucking money they stole from black folks from their own people. 
And I tell you why. You want to know why? Because like I said, she said the same thing. Uh, one of my uh, dude I know uh, was asking. He, he finally, he asked, what, what, did you file your taxes? They, they're so fucking stupid. The motherfuckers are stupid. All right. So anyway, said the same thing. You know, I, I, I made a certain amount. And y'all know it. I say it all the time. I'm honest. I don't work. You know, I, and I told y'all why I don't have to work like that. And so they so fucking stupid. They really thought they got me. You know, they got you that I had. Because he said, see, you let the middle class. Right? No, you stupid bitch. Why the fuck are you goddamn trying to start all this fucking shit? Oh, because you're fucking corrupt and need like this whole ass nigga right there. Right there, these two motherfuckers. You kept all the real niggas from getting a job. So your bitch ass, look at you getting nervous and scared. Can't even find his fucking key. That's why I told you, he a bitch. Fucking nervous like a little bitch. Stupid ass nigga. So anyway, look, they trying to get loud now. Let's let's see what they say. Yeah, yeah, she said keep talking. Let's see. Yeah, he got shook. You can't save him, bitch. She the bitch. You can't save that fuck nigga. Stay with him. You are gonna die with him. So anyway, y'all could die together, like like Biggie. So anyway, ride it together. We die together. Fed the fucking guy. We hope to die together. Yeah, fuck nigga. So anyway. These motherfuckers mad cause they they all they 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 finna come down crumbling. The 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 little they they the the shit that they was riding on that they had everybody thinking. Well it really didn't even have motherfuckers. The real niggas knew cause they went out and did it. They had everybody their their gilding ticket. Oh, it's white folks, it's racism. It's it's racism. And they're the ones keeping the other niggas down. That's why they also for the Mexicans and the illegals. That's why they want illegals and Mexicans. They, cause they know everybody, nobody's buying that shit. Black folks ain't buying it. So they need a whole new class to keep down. So anyway, like I said, the bitch I was talking, they came in talking loud, trying, like they're schooling people. So finally I said, I got to the line. Finally I said something. You know, they're, they're right next to me having this loud ass conversation. And uh, I said, you know what? Because I knew it because it had to do with the uh, conversation I had two weeks ago with uh, with the dude that I know. And he, he you know, he asked, oh, because she, she said, yeah. oh, yeah. now, so now these ignorant, libtard motherfuckers are, oh, if you didn't file taxes, because he had, that's what he started. I still got the text. I got the text. So, like I said, I still got the proof, little bitch. So, anyway, he said, well, did you file your taxes in the last three years? And, and, and like I said, I'm like, when the fuck? And you know, make it so bad. The reason I know I didn't have to was because I asked the IRS agent, a little agent. So this stupid bitch I was talking to just now, well, about 40 minutes ago, this, this, this little bitch, she said, oh, I know what I'm talking about because I've been preparing taxes for 15, basically, she, you know, H&R or whatever. Maybe uh, uh, she's a tax preparer. So she thinks she's schooling me. And like I said, make it so bad. The, the the reason I asked, I don't even remember. I still don't remember why I kept going to see it. Because I it's right up the street. It's literally like up the street to the tax office, to the IRS office. Not, I didn't go because she said it. After she kept trying to shut me down, then finally she realized I wasn't talking about it. She said, because first she's like, oh, that person told you wrong. You went to the, I'm like, and now she saw that I got a screwed look on my face. Not because I was angry, because I'm in my head, I'm picturing the agent. A IRS agent, meaning I had to go to the place I was at. I had to, you know, they got the guards. It's the IRS. I had to make an appointment. Like today, it's Thursday. You go in there. I, I, they say, hey, well, you know, this is what you can't no walk-ins. You got to call. Make an appointment. That's how I know about my fucking taxes, you stupid bitch. You so busy trying to argue every fucking time because you so fucking stupid. You don't fucking listen. And I'm not trying. See, that's the thing. They always trying to make it like a, a back and forth thing, trying to figure who's smarter. No, bitch, you coming at me. You came at me. If you wouldn't have came at me, I wouldn't have to say none of this shit. You should have left me the fuck alone. Leave me the fuck alone and then don't stay out my fucking, you know, it ain't, ain't even stay out my business like I'm doing something bad. It just, I know what your program is. I know, and I literally mean program. Like I said, your shit failed, the impeachment failed. Hell, at least you, you can say you're part of the group that tried to overthrow the fucking president. <laughs> you know, these motherfuckers, get, 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 pat yourself on the back when y'all tried. But you're fucking idiots. Like I said, you're a bunch of fucking idiots. Disgusting, stupid-ass idiots. So anyway, 
finally she had to say, she said, oh, you asked, because I had to tell her, I said, no, right on this such and such street. I went to the, I, she said, oh, you went to, a, I, oh, well, if he told you that, you know, because I, matter of fact, I took him my fucking paper, you know, whatever, your W-2s and showed on, because I, because actually, I was going to, knowing that I wasn't going to get a return. I just was like, well, should I file? You know, I just wanted to file. I don't know why. I just wanted to. He said, no, there's no re- not 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 a fucking tax preparer. Because no, then she said, oh, H&R Block. And I said, no, the fucking IRS. I didn't say fucking IRS. The IRS, an agent, looked at my shit and said, no. And so you hit me with, and you ain't filed your tax in the last three years. And then you wonder why I'm so disgusted with you disgusting ass niggas. Because you trying to start shit that you, it's like you spy, if you're going to spy, do it right. If you're going to fucking spy on me, spy on, don't spy half of the time and then, and then make assumptions. Fucking stupid ass bitch. All these motherfuckers, look at them. Just dumb shit, you know, this is that, wow, wow, wow. Fucking cut your shit out, stupid ass bitch. You won't get cussed out if you stop fucking with folks. And try to play it off and try to, you know, they try to use all this other shit. Oh, it must be this. It must be something. No, bitch, it's you. You can't fuck with folks. I don't care how you try to play it off. You're not smart. You're not fooling nobody. You're not smooth fooling nobody at all. You you can't antagonize people. Then, to, oh, it must be because he something happened. Oh, it must be because it's this. Or he must have a conflict. No, bitch, you can't. But we all learned that shit in grade school, middle school. We all took psychology in science class. All right, you're not smart. You're not fooling nobody. You're just a fucking con artist. We all know about Sigmund Freud. We all well, okay. You're not gonna fool anybody. Like I said, you're at the point, just give up. Make it easy on yourselves. Just give up. The more you keep trying, the more you're pissing people off. Trying to cut, just still stop it. Just fucking stop it. Maybe people have fucking mercy on you if you just admit the shit. So anyway, let me uh, show the, the, this shit. Uh, I decided instead of trying to post them, you know, one by one, because they're short videos, I just fucking play them about uh, what happened on my little trip today. Make it right, they can walk that way. They can literally, there's no reason to walk down this way all of a sudden. And you can say, well, maybe it's because they have to stay at home now, they've been at work. Okay, like I said, you hear all those cars back there? It's a main road. As a matter of fact, there's a trail, a health fitness field trail. Here's another way to let's just get through walking this way. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, the last two days. Oh, you know, sure when I was right talking there. that other video, right there, that's where the main exit is. You make where the stop sign, make it right. They can walk that way. They can literally, there's no reason to walk down this way all of a sudden. And you can say, well, maybe it's because they have to stay at home now. They've been at work. Okay, like I said, you hear all those cars back there? It's a main road. As a matter of fact, there's a trail, a health fitness field trail, right down there. You can go on that trail. The motherfuckers, the, the moms be running with the the kids in the fucking uh, strollers. There's a fucking trail right five minutes from here. Here's another way to must just get through walking this way. Last, like I said, last two days. All hey, when I was talking that other video, right there. That's where the main exit is. You make where the stop sign, make it right. They can walk that way. They can literally, there's no reason to walk down this way all of a sudden. And you can say, well, maybe it's because they have to stay at home now. They've been at work. Okay, like I said, you hear all those cars back there? 
It's a main road. It's, it's a matter of fact, there's a trail, a health fitness field trail, right down there. You can go on that trail. The motherfucker, the, the moms be running with the the kids in the fucking uh, strollers. There's a fucking trail, right? Enough, but it was a weirdo with the yellow and black on doing some uh, sanitation station. It basically, it just like uh, it's like a, a video of one of those fifties doing the right thing. You remember stop, drop, and roll? Them type of videos. Not stop, drop, and roll, but uh, during the atomic scare duck and cover during the atomic you know when they had this uh, Cuban Missile Crisis duck and cover like uh, at the time when they thought ducking under the table would save their ass from a nuclear explosion it wasn't fast enough but it was a weirdo with the yellow and black on doing some uh, sanitation station it basically it just like uh, it's like a, a video of one of those 50s doing the right thing. You remember stop, drop, and roll? Them type of videos. Not stop, drop, and roll, but uh, during the atomic scare. Duck and cover. During the atomic, you know, when they had that uh, Cuban Missile Crisis. Duck played and twice. My fault. Like, uh, video at the time. That shit played twice. Yeah, I saw him when I was getting out of my car and him right there. He did a symbol with his hat. I can't get his face. I'm not finna follow him. But like I said, this is the gang stalkers if they're out there, they're doing this full force. Like I said, he did the symbol with his hat when I saw him in the parking lot. That's what made me turn around when he was right here. I think it was my old buddy. But uh yeah, we'll see. Not a real old buddy. I met uh, the dude who's always, I've talked about him before. He's always uh, pointing out one of my hats. And I'm like, we don't wear hats because we're sports fans. You know, we might be a sports fan. He might actually generally, but anyway, long story short, he's always there. I, I, poor guy. But. Like I said, I was taught to, you know, document. That shit happened, right? So, again, like when I was going to work the other night, and it was like 12, 10 a.m. All right, so now what they do when they discover, I guess, like immediately, like they're running an operation and they discover I'm on to them, they immediately turn off. Because the one reason I know it, because the streets you turn on, many people don't turn there. I I noticed them when I pulled on the stoplight, stop sign, well, stop light. And she was rubbing her hands together like she had just used hand sanitizer. Now, watch the video I just made when I was at the supermarket. It, the, I guess that's their new symbol. So she's in the, in the lane next to me. And, I, you know, I just haven't turned my head to the right or the left, rather. And she's rubbing her hands together. You know, I, had to, I had to take away. She just used hand sanitizer. Yeah, he stopped it. Oh, there you go. The little hoe ass nigga. See, it would be different with their generation. They're like, oh, you old heads. You know, y'all, like I said, when I look, he has this little water bottle. And he's happy. He's, they're, they're doing, he's doing some little symbol. You know what I'm saying? Look, look, like I said, when I was your age, bitch, I, I, I ain't do no dancing hoe ass shit. We wasn't dancing. We was making fucking money, bitch. See what I'm saying? We wasn't dancing and shit, walking with the nigga. I had a car, but so did so did my 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 uh, crew. So I wasn't staying in my mama apartment, you know. So he came out. He just came out like like it's basically like they're standing up against me. Like who? Why are you standing? You know what? What am I? So he came out like in defiance. You know he was dancing. He doing some little whole shit. The reason our generation don't like dancing, you little nigga. Is because we just didn't dance because that shit was whole shit. You look like a bitch, nigga. I know, I, I know. I'm an old head. I, 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 hey, 
Normally, I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't give a fuck. Dance to your heart's content. But when you're doing it at, like, 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 there's some gangster shit. Do you dance? Like little hoe. That, no, I dance for the hoes, nigga. Dance for the bitches. Don't dance for me. You ain't got to dance in front of me. Dance for the hoes. But uh. You know, it's not black. You not, you know, your hand up in the air like this Soweto or this is a apartheid, nigga. You not getting fucking. This is not apartheid. You don't stay in South Africa in the fucking eighties, seventies, sixties. Nelson Mandela ain't locked up. You not with your fist in the hell. You know, you're not black Zulu. You doing some whole shit, nigga. These motherfuckers ain't black. They ain't motherfucking pro blacks. They ain't fucking for you, you stupid bitch. You, they they got you fucked up. You on their side. They ain't got you generational wealth. They got you generational getting fucked up. They got you generationally fucked up, stupid ass nigga. <laughs> Why you up there uh, dance with your hand in the air like this? It's, you know what I'm saying? Like it's the red, black, and green and all this shit back in the day. No fuck nigga. They got you fucked up. Real fucked up. <laughs> Scary ass little bitch. But anyway... Look, see what I'm saying? They got the women doing all the dirty work, talking shit, because they women. You know, they know we ain't going to fuck with them. Let's, 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 let's see what they getting loud about. Like I said, husbandless women, fatherless children, you know, they really got to that point where they think, you know, you ain't gonna fuck with my baby. No, tell your baby, stop fucking around and shit that he can't handle. Like I said, when I was his age, I admit it. I admit it. Not that I didn't ha can handle it. That's my point. I admit it. I know what I'm doing. I wasn't running back to my mama if I got in trouble with the law or whatever. <laughs> You know, it is what it is. I, it, it, actually, it made me mad back there when they was blaming the parents. And I, Look, no, no, we know what the fuck we doing. Hell, niggas, they don't, don't treat us like children. This shit. I, I'm sorry. I'm not advocating niggas getting killed. I know motherfuckers. That's not what I'm just saying. If you the motherfucker that did it, own up to that shit. Nigga, you fucking with the wrong motherfucker right now. Ain't nobody finna have to keep listening to these dumb bitches. I ain't calling them bitches because I hate women or nothing like that. They literally out here trying to start shit, but they don't want to hide behind, oh, I'm just a woman. Like I said. If you're a woman, you know better than to start shit. If you're a woman, you know better than to try to get the hell, get your boyfriend killed. Why are you trying to get your boyfriend killed? You're deliberately trying to get him killed. What type of woman does that? You're a bitch. You're not a woman. You're a hoe. You're trying to get your boyfriend killed. Mur murked out there in the street. Not murdered. Murked. Self-defense. And why? Investigation. Oh, well, his girlfriend was upset. They had an altercation with another man. His uh, yeah, her boyfriend. And he tried to fight. Da, 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 da. Now the boyfriend's dead. Plain and simple. Case of self defense. Sorry, man. We can't prosecute the dude. Next time, keep your mouth shut. You see what I'm saying? That's how, that's how it's gonna go. Ain't nobody finna die behind y'all. You know what I'm saying? If you're a woman, you ain't trying to get your boyfriend killed. So you can go on, and he did. You could play the. You ain't even gonna be a widow. You just gonna be the baby mom and the girlfriend. You're not gonna be a legal widow. You just. Oh, Pookie got killed last year on this day. You, you and his kids gonna be having wearing t-shirts, placing flowers on his grave every day on this year for the next for the rest of their lives. You know, you go. Why you want your kids to be disadvantaged like that? Shut your fucking mouth. Oh, and matter of fact, the woman who was uh, brought up the tax thing, she gets into a car just like that one. See that white car? A motherfucking, but it's a red Acura. Bright red Acura, the one I talked to, was who asked for fair taxes, who was trying to tell, I don't know what the fuck, because there was nobody in the store. It was just me and the cashier and them two. You know, who are like, this is not, they free money. The, 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 bitch, y'all are the ones who want socialism. Y'all the ones, your, your leaders. 
release this fucking bullshit pandemic that they, they, they try to they experiment to see how it's total control because y'all want to, total control. It, I could, it, it is like it is almost you would want to ask. I don't I don't know why they would want total control, but it, it's the, these motherfuckers. They're mad. They really thought that they would do a better job of ruling ruling everybody. You're not finna rule shit. You crazy bitch. It's not finna work like that. It's not going down. Like I said, so she, they're, they're up there telling me, oh, this is free money. And she's trying, like I said, she was trying to school me. Uh, uh, I don't know why. Total, supposed, supposedly, total strange. They come in, just happen to have, in a dollar store, these two motherfuckers, she's in a red Acura. It's, look, she's she coughing. She just coughing. Just happen to show up in a dollar, dollar whatever the fuck. I, like I said, I'm buying some shit I use to clean off my sneakers. Whatever. That's literally all I went for. I got, I got a little piece of whatever the fuck on my sneakers. That's where I went. But uh, they in there talking loud, just like them two having a conversation. But it's a male, like I said, he he's a little fruity male, and he uh laughing. He came in the you know just laughing loud, yeah, 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 you know, with the with the bitch, and you know they're talking about oh this they're like they're both smart. And she's a tax preparer. I'm doing air quotes. You know, I, I feel you know shit. You probably lost people some fucking money over the last fifteen years. It's your dumbass. If they let you uh, prepare their taxes. So anyway, you passing out bad advice and you charge these motherfuckers for bad advice. You know, niggas, man. These motherfuckers sick, disgusting. They so busy worrying about, you know, if you want to show up on each other, that's what y'all do when you go to the club. Don't try to get into politics with your fucking, you know, your, your type of way of attitudes. You know what I'm saying? You gotta you just put on your fucking heels and dress, and you go slay niggas at, at the and the bitches at the club. But don't fucking try to come to politics with that man. If you want to get into politics, you are gonna have to do things the right way, not your way. A ain't no, don't try to spread this bullshit. You know, trying to outdo each other. If you want to do a good job, do a fucking good job because you know what you're doing, not because you're trying to show people out. Crazy ass shit. You know what I'm saying? It, like I said, she, she gets it to That's when, when we went outside. That's when I saw a car, right? And that's when she uh, finally admits. She, well, not admits, but it comes out. Like, I ain't even know why they even brought up this shit two weeks ago, the taxes and shit. And like I said, when I had asked the guy about should I file, I was in there for something else. And he was trying to hurt. He looked, he's like, no, you, you, what you, what you no, nah, don't even, don't even worry about it. You know, there's no reason to file. And so they trying again. It, these, 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 it's some crazy ass shit. The same motherfuckers who swear they don't trust the police. They're trying what it is. Like I said, this is. But they, they, when it comes to them and them trying to get ahead, they, they agree with the rules and the set rules and the white folks rules. And you know they make jokes. Oh, they gonna end up in jail. You ain't pay. You know. But at the same time, they're being discreet. They're the ones doing all of the crying and, and black lives matter. All this bullshit. They're the same ones. These motherfuckers right there. If you can see, you probably can't see because of the way the sun position. Same motherfuckers right there because they're corrupt. That's what it was. They and they they don't give a fuck about the rules, tax rules. They only care what they're doing. They're trying to cut. They're scared. They're running like fucking rats. That's why they're out here talking now. You know, they don't want us talking. They don't want nobody to know that they're fucked. They can't take it. They can't do things the real way. They can't take, you know, being doing things the hard way or whatever. They can't take it. They're fucked. And they know they're fucked. They ain't going to make it. Like that little boy that came out, you know, with a little water jug, throwing his water jug up in the air, literally on tape. That's another thing. That's some stupid ass shit. Your OG should beat your ass for being stupid. Like, you know, that nigga across the street filming y'all. It doesn't, even if it's the slightest chance. See, that's what I'm saying. They're so stupid. They're arrogant. Even if it's the slightest chance, man, I ain't gonna, it is, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, no. That shows you right there. They, they, like I said, you fucked up, little boy. You fucked up in life. They got your head fucked up. You're stupid. You're probably gonna end up dead or in prison. I ain't even talking about like before. I'm not saying it like when our generation, they was wishing that on us because you were doing stupid. No, because you're fucking stupid. <laughs> you committing crimes on tape just like you you know what I'm saying and, and dancing about it <laughs> so the judge gonna get mad cause you fucking dancing about this shit stupid ass nigga he gonna give you extra years cause you didn't show goddamn remorse you fucking stupid they got y'all fucked up <laughs>